What's up everyone, Elite Sniper 16 here. Today, <laughs> Elite Sniper 16 here. And today we're gonna, uh, we're gonna basically teach you how to, uh, well basically I'm gonna teach you how to install uh, the uh, Halo mod. Operation Chirp, I don't know, but whatever. Uh, basically it'll be in the title, basically what the title says. But yeah, anyways, <laughs> I can't say the name correctly. But anyways, uh, right now I'm on my, on my own Wasteland server as you can see. Uh, there's a lot of stuff you could do here. I just want to talk about it a little bit before we actually start the video or the actual download stuff and how to install it and crap like that. But anyways, so this is my Wasteland server. It's open. You guys could join. It's to you know once you download the mod pack and stuff. I have this is how I'm gonna basically teach you. It's basically for the people that want to join my server and also for those people that don't know how to download the mod uh, itself. So basically, right now, uh, I have a lot of things. I keep on saying basically but anyways um i have a lot of things going on for the server i will be adding custom scripts of my own and stuff as you see here i i added the epoch uh status bar thing or the bar um that i liked so i, I got that and i added it here uh, a little help from the forms they helped me but anyways so uh there's a lot of things there's conquest as you can see here there's uh fucking you can sell your vehicles or services and there's uh basically missions that you could do i'll be up up uh, upgrading the uh, mission things to or upgrade count of the missions like there's only four that only display around the map so far right now but i'll be upgrading that to like uh six or eight missions where y'all could go and do that and stuff but anyways uh in the shops it's all up updated you could buy pelicans you could fucking buy war hogs doesn't matter you can see here there's fucking oh wait light armor it's armored that's why uh, Warhog, I think I spelled it wrong. If I spelled it wrong, just let me know, guys. I'm a fucking idiot at times at spelling. Uh, the, right now, the Pelican, the arm one only, is in the uh, helicopters. You could get the unarmed Pelican at the airdrop right here. Vehicles, and then the Pelican Black, and then it's Warhog Armed, and uh, Warhog uh, Civilian Black. And then there's another mission right now where you could hack, or it's actually another mission too, uh, enemy laptop, where you could hack uh, enemy bank accounts. And you could get money from from basically enemies. But anyways, yeah, there's there's a lot of things you go here. There's also base saving, where you could uh, save your base, which I will show you mine real quick. I'm just trying to rush this because I know you guys really want to install the thing. But um, wow, that didn't even teleport me. Okay, that was weird. You're not gonna teleport me or what? There you go. Sorry about that. But um. But yeah, so we could go in here. There's basically my base. You guys could literally come over here. I don't care because everything's locked. We have a uh, base property. That's why. Uh, you could see here. Let me go right here. If I can fucking click it, I think I could click it right now. I think it's being an idiot with me. But whatever. Basically, this little laptop here is a base property, and it protects your your stuff around your base from people taking it. See right here. You can't really pick it up. It says. Um, doesn't give me the option to pick it up or anything. As you can see, it doesn't say, oh, you can pick it up and move it. Uh, this one I can unlock because it was my vehicle. But, um, but yeah, guys. So, let's actually get to installing the mods. Alright, so let's actually go to my website. We need to go to my website. Uh, you're gonna go to, here, let me close that. So, what we're gonna do will be a link down in the description. It'll be linked to this, basically, leeanimations.net. And you'll be uh, taken here to uh, this right, basically right here has my live stream. I live stream all the time, um, basically around like one in the morning for uh, the uh, for Central Time, U.S. Central Time. And so we're gonna go forms, then we're gonna go to Arma Three. There's a lot of stuff here that you could you know, GTA and stuff. I'll be adding GTA mods and stuff like that. But anyways, you go into the forms, then you're gonna go to uh halo waste on server which is gonna be an announcement right now because right now it's being announced because we for you guys where you guys could just download it click it or clear faster and go to here but i'll leave this link here that's also the forms link the view topic blah 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 uh and down in the description as well for you guys could just click that real quick but you know it's just a way for i can show you guys how to go to the forms from my website all right so now you're gonna click download mod pack you're gonna go there it's gonna take you to a separate uh page not in a new tab on i'm sorry guys but uh but yeah it's gonna take you there and then you're gonna click skip add once you skip it you're gonna be redirected to the uh, mod pack you're gonna click download boom you're downloading it I'm just gonna cancel it cuz I already have it now what I'm gonna go back to do is I'm gonna go back to my website I'm gonna go back to my forms just real quick 
and just go there. Now, while you guys are downloading that, I'm just gonna go back here. Boom. All right. So I'll be letting you guys know whenever there's a new update on the. Uh, could look at their stuff and see when they're updating and stuff. Basically, whenever they update their mod, I'll be updating my mod too because it's part of my server. So the mod pack will be updated to you know whatever date. So let's say they released it uh, April 19. Okay. Well. Let's say I download it and then I don't upload it into the next day or something or maybe like a few hours later. Um, I'll let you know the date and the time of, of my time that I downloaded and I put it in uh, you updated the uh, mod pack and stuff. Now here's the features of or the feature the features of what's in the Halo 83 uh, wasteland that we I'm making you know conquest we are blah blah blah. It's gonna be a lot of stuff into it like I said. But anyways, here's the whole ban list where you can see if you're banned or not or it's basically a global ban list so if people want to use it they can use the ban list too um, but yeah so that, that's that mainly all hackers as you can see a lot of hackers it's like 300 and something hackers but anyways yeah so here's TeamSpeak if you need more uh, information or if you need help uh, installing the mods there's more information there uh, TeamSpeak and then here's the uh, server IP for you to join but anyways so we're gonna go back to the sorry give me a second here we go so here it is what you're gonna do is that you're gonna go to if you don't know how to go to your your um your steam stuff well then you, there's there's your there's two easy ways to do it or a easy way to do it go go to steam right click properties right click armor 3 properties local files browser local files now boom you're in there now if you're the late if you want to go the long way like how the way i do you go to local uh, desktop uh Programs, files, uh, you know, x86. Scroll it down, go to Steam. Now go to Steam Apps, Common, and then Armor 3. Boom, you're in there. Same thing, doesn't matter, so I'm just gonna close this. Uh, now I need to go to the. That's Bandit Camp. I need to go to my mods folder real quick, guys. Give me a second. So I'm just gonna open up the Altus, my Altus thing. I'm just gonna go desktop. I have a lot of desktop crap. But anyway, so we're gonna go to Armor 3 mods. Now the mod pack, here it is. Because I'll be updating this. Now, in the mod pack that you guys can receive, you're going to have Task Force Radio. Unless if I update it before I upload the video. But anyways, you guys are going to uh, come up with Task Force Radio. Just delete that. You really don't need it. Um, that That's the thing I put it. I was testing and I don't know why I, I didn't test it first and then updated it. Um, but anyways, um, I removed Task Force Radio from my server. So you don't really need that. Unless if you guys just want to keep Task Force Radio for yourself, then you guys could use it. But anyways... So this is all the working CBA f uh, files that is needed for the uh, operation thing. Uh, user configs in there too. Also for Task Force Radio still. And I don't know what the hell this was. But just I don't know. Just keep. I guess you guys could delete it. Just at least keep the uh, operation thing in there. And the Task Force Radio. If you're going to use the Task Force Radio. You could just delete the rest. Like I said. I'm just lazy to update it right now. But anyways. So to prove that it's working for me. I'm going to delete the uh, CBA for me. I'm going to delete operation thing. And I'm going to delete the user config. Now I'm just going to copy and paste. Now, if you just open up the zip file or the raw file, you could just copy the whole folder or the the, uh, the files and just drag them into there. That's what I usually do, but, you know, whatever. All right, so I uh, close that because now it's being transferred. So now it's just transferring all the folders. It's taking a while to transfer because um, all the, um, the stuff that's in it and also cause since I'm recording. <laughs> All right, so there's all that. Boom, I'm done. Now, uh, I don't know the way you guys launch it. Before, I, the way I used to launch it, I'll go to set, set launch options. Boom, there's the mod stuff that's there. I'll also put this down in the description for you guys could just uh, copy that and paste it. Boom, you're set. Uh, there's two ways you could... There, okay, there's three ways you could technically do that. There's that one you could do set launch options, like I said. Property, set launch options, blah, blah. Now, if you don't want to do that and you just click play, it'll take you to the launcher. Go to parameter. Prime matter. I can't even say no more. What are prime matter? <sighs> I'm gonna kill myself. I can't say no more. Okay. Well, anyways, you go there. You go here, and um, you can either click mods, and then you're gonna click this thing. It'll take you to your Armor Three directory. Directory. Damn it. And then you just you make sure when you click your first one, like CBA, you hold left, left control. You just you know you could scroll down. Oh shit! Not scroll down. Sorry. Never mind. Don't scroll down. Worst worst thing you can do. Um, I fucked up my thing now. Okay, whatever. Uh, oh, there it is. Okay, so just okay. Hold control. Go with this little thing right here. Um, just go down until you find the operation. Boom, you got it. 
Don't hold shift, because if you hold shift, you're going to highlight a lot of shit. So, don't do that. I just highlighted a lot of shit. <laughs> but, um... I gotta go find CBA again. I think I made everything in or like organized. Son of a Oh wait, nope. I fucking went back. I went back. Some bitch. I went back before I actually went put CBA and stuff. Well, I gotta pause the video. Give me a second guys. Alright, so I click control Z. Basically, I went back. Uh, so, yeah, anyways, I'm going to click CBA, and then I'm going to click the operation. Boom, there you go. And then you're going to click select. Boom, there it is. Now, I put CBA first because, well, I just feel like it's, since it's CBA and everyone, everything, all, most of the need CBA. But anyways, so, yeah, you could do that one, or you could just go to command line parameters and just copy that thing I just put there. Now, I'm going to go with this one because I'm, I'm used to that, and I really hate that thing right there because I always delete my mods like I just did. But anyways... Um, click. I'll click play, but uh, I'm gonna hop on my server right now if I click play. But anyways, so uh, yeah, if you guys have any more issues, like I said, just go to my team speak. I'm on there, uh, or go on my server. I'm always looking at my server and seeing who's connecting to my server and stuff, and just watching some people. Uh, I use the uh, Archon too, so I'm just on there looking at chat at times and stuff. So yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and um, I hope I see you guys on my server. And I'm looking for admin, so if you guys want to be an admin, just tell me and I'll hook you. Oh, I'll say I'll hook you up, but uh, I'll uh, I'll talk to you through a little interview and stuff. But uh, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed. Peace out.